baked, this is about the size of the cookie is. Here's my hand for comparison. So I can remember the first time T-Rex cookie was on TV. These cookies. cookies are enormous. They're like half pound cookies. And um, this woman named uh, Tina Rexing, she quit her job at Target about four, four or five months ago. And then she's also trying to launch a, a food truck that's kind of going to be like fashioned like an old milk truck and have milk and cookies and go around town. Right? It. She hasn't launched that's it yet, smart. but she's working on it. I think I'm going to be looking for a newer vintage. Basically, when I first started the company, I knew that social media was like necessary in order to launch any company this day and age. And so it was really important for me to be out there on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And that's how the Today Show found me, was basically all my Facebook followers voted for my cookie to be the best cookie in Minnesota. And next thing I know, I'm in New York. These are sea salt caramel chocolate chips, right? Uh, so December, I was on the Today Show uh, 2015. Let's just make sure it's done. Ooh. It's done. We're going to be closing to the public December 31st. Um, and I'll be using the entire month of January kind of transitioning the business um, basically from Minneapolis to a spot in Egan where I'm going to build out a commercial kitchen. Welcome to my new home. We'll be our storage room for all our cookie dough. Our freezers are going to go here. The plan is that the oven is going to go here. It's just kind of starting all over again. It's just like the same feeling I had two years ago when I moved into the university location. But I feel like there's a little bit more pressure on me because now people kind of know my business. And so there's pressure that I get it right. You know, my personality, and people will tell you, is that I tend to muscle through things um, to get it done. And this is not going to be any different. So just getting ready to muscle through this one. I'm shopping for a food truck because the situation has changed so I basically can go back to what I wanted to do from the very beginning was take the cookies on the road. I could use like just a countertop heater and then... And that's what that is. It's got, you know, 275,000 miles on it. This is a nice machine. Is this the $10,000 machine that she's talking about? Yeah. Hi friends, look at this potential truck that I might be buying. I'm not sure yet. We have to figure out where the battery is so we can jump start it. Giving it gas. Yeah. Oh, hey. I'm hoping to be able to carry the quirkiness of this store into the food truck adventure. I'm not very good at asking for help, but I think in this case, because everyone has come along for the ride, for the T-Rex cookie ride. Um, this will be a great spot to launch a Kickstarter where people can be part of it and get a piece of T-Rex cookie and kind of um, be part of the story as we move into the next chapter. Needs new time. Okay. A large donation you can get a few of these. We're kind of piecemealing selling stuff, so all the tables and chairs are for sale, and people are coming in buying like little bits and pieces. Mm -hmm.